has been well established in the medical literature for years that women who are supplementing their diet with folic acid significantly reduce the risk of what is referred to as neural tube or congenital defects in their children. These are defects like spina bifida and hydrocephalus. However, what was very critical was the fact that the women needed to be supplementing at least 400 to 800 micrograms of folic acid prior to becoming pregnant to receive this health benefit. If they waited until after they knew they were pregnant, it was just too late. The main reason for needing to supplement prior to getting pregnant is the fact that folic acid is a key nutrient in the proper development of the brain and spinal cord. Having adequate levels present at the time of conception and early development of the unborn child is critical. By the time a woman realizes she is pregnant and then sees her physician, the brain and spinal cord has basically already been developed. This is why it is critical for any woman who wants to get pregnant or may possibly get pregnant that they need to be supplementing their diet with at least 400 to 800 micrograms of folic acid. Now, there is new research that has just been reported in the February 13, 2013 Journal of American Medical Association that is showing an even better reason why many women or a mother who is trying to get pregnant should be supplementing with folic acid. These findings come out of the Norwegian Mother and Child Cohort Study where they followed over 85,000 children. Their main interest was in observing the children of mothers who had supplemented with folic acid for at least four to eight weeks prior to getting pregnant compared to those mothers who did not supplement folic acid. What they observed was simply amazing. The use of folic acid supplements at least four to eight weeks prior to becoming pregnant lowered their risk of the baby developing autism by over 50%. Another amazing study released in the October 12, 2012 Journal of American Medical Association also looked at the effect of folic acid supplementation in regards to severe language delay in their children. The Norwegian mother and child cohort study again observed nearly 39,000 children born of mothers who either received folic acid or did not receive folic acid four to eight weeks prior to becoming pregnant. Again, the children whose mothers supplemented with folic acid, compared to those who didn't, had over a 50% reduction in this severe language delay in their children at three years of age. When you consider the health benefit of taking nutritional supplements in all adults, it seems very wise to recommend that everyone consume what I refer to as cellular nutrition as a very important healthy lifestyle. However, it becomes very important to me that when I diagnose someone as being pregnant, that they have already been taking a high-quality nutritional supplement that contains at least 800 micrograms of folic acid. These clinical trials assures the mother that she has already been protecting her unborn child and that her child not only has a significant decreased risk of being born with a neural tube defect, but also significantly decreases the risk that her child will have a severe language delay or develop autism. I personally believe that the RX Optimals along with Omega Q offers the woman who might get pregnant as well as the pregnant mother the best prenatal nutrition support in the marketplace today.